Going first day out, first flight, loved it. Amazing little drone. I knew it would be. What I wanted to do today was to prove that you don't need a controller to fly this drone. And you don't. If you want to do a circle, you want to do a follow, um, a selfie, a rocket, you can do all that without a controller because it's got a built-in screen there and it tells you what it can do. But what I wanted to do, because I watched the DJI, um, one of the instruction videos, and it said you can do the gesture control. And that, what that is, is using your palm of your hand and taking control of the drone. Now, they've done this a while ago. Well, a long time ago, really. I think it started with a Spark. And then when they brought out the Mavic Air, <clears throat> you could do a couple more things. And it does look very similar to that. But... <laughs> Uh, as I went to try and do that, you do need your phone, guys, unfortunately. And luckily I did, really, because on the phone, as I went into it, because this video, really, guys, is designed for somebody that hasn't even flown a drone. For, you know, for us guys that have been flying drones for quite a while, it, even that, even for me, it's a learning experience. But you do need your phone. You go into your phone, it's pretty simple. As soon as you go into your DJI fly up, they both connect straight in away. <clears throat> and you go straight into it. So that's what this video is about. If you know, if you watch any of my videos, nothing's planned. I just go straight into it. There's a few mishaps. <laughs> well, that's me. But anyway, I hope you enjoy it. This, I'll tell you what, guys, this is going to be on the Christmas list. Hi. See, this is a bit with now. And I might not be able to uh, carry on. No, so I'll push it far back, go up, swing it down, down, bring it up. I forgot one major thing. For us goggle people that wear glasses, now obviously here in Spain, I always wear my sunglasses, Polaroid, but when, you, when the screen comes on, you can hardly see it. It's a bit like when I'm at the petrol pumps. I have to take my glasses off, but because I can't see very well. So, another tip from Sean the Drone. If you're wearing Perloids, you ain't gonna see what's going on on that screen. <laughs> so just wear your normal glasses for us goggle people. Okay, so I was watching a video yesterday, <clears throat> as you do with YouTube, and it did say, choose a suitable flight environment. And one of the things it does say, and I thought, oh, okay, avoid water, um, avoid texture, backgrounds, and don't fly over, don't fly off a bridge or balcony. Now, that's obviously to do with the wind uptake, <clears throat> but you can do it in a well-lit area, open areas, clear and breezy weather. I don't know what I mean by breezy. So anyway, so... No doubt there's going to be loads of videos of people flying over the water just to test it, aren't they? So your flight. Um, take off, follow mode. We've got return to home landing. Maybe I should have looked at this first. Because <laughs> it's my first flight. So, let's see what happens. I think it's a good idea, this, because... Um, Turn camera towards subject and press okay. take off button to start. So it's going through all the stages there. Do not switch off your mode. Pinch both side aircraft below. Camera facing you. Uh, it will take off in three seconds. And it, it does say that button with the red line in it. If you feel that you don't want it to take off. If you press it again, it will cancel that, that load. So we're going to do that. Let's do that first thing. The aircraft okay. is now... So, I mean, I got it really close to me. I'm doing fine. Right. Extend arm and okay. open palm Return to home to and land. Extend and your land palm. palm. So, that's what I'm going to do. Land. Press select okay. buttons on aircraft it's, side to it view was nearly in, but then it is a bit windy. So, we've done that. Okay, switch modes. Okay. Um, I don't need to do that. Right, the switch modes. Okay, we could do that then. We're just going to go through 
what it says. We we'll do a selfie shot. Why not? Okay. We've got a selfie. Select selfie. And then I'll just presume we press the button. Yeah? Three shot sizes. Selfie shot. Three, two, one. Okay, it's going to do three shots, apparently. High angle and wide. Three, two, one. Full. So it's coming back in. Three, two. Okay, it's doing a one. it's doing a low one. Medium. Three. And it's doing another two, one a little bit closer. One. Interestingly. Okay. Captured. Aircraft returning home automatically. <laughs> We'll press skip and that. hold select buttons on aircraft All right, side. Shoot and perimeter to adjustment. Press and hold press the button on the aircraft side for two seconds. To okay, so that's what we've got to do. We've got to press the thingy. Okay, let's bring it in. Landing. Okay, so what it's saying now is to the perimeters, we press it for two seconds. Okay, so this is a good way of learning, I think. <laughs> it does say finish tutorial. Okay, so I've got that. First flight, first flight completed. I don't think it really did. Oh, guess the control. Do you want to start that? Yes. Okay. We're going to see if that works. <laughs> All right. Now I see on the on the screen here. I've actually got that gesture thing. Let's put. Okay. So apparently. Okay, it's still following me. If I stick my palm out. And. Okay, so it's doing it now. Right. So I was hoping I wouldn't be able to do it at the controller, but anyway, I'm just going to bring that around. I'm just going to come. I'm just going to come back this way so you can see what's going on. I've got my palm up still. Okay. You can see this. I mean, we've got a bit of wind now, unfortunately, and I might not be able to uh, carry on with this. So if I put my palm up, it's going to go up, if I bring it down, it's going to come down, obviously bring it up, right, if I go, right, I'm just going to have to, it's alright, put that down, I should have bought a chair, <laughs> okay, so I've got two palms up now, and if I, put the palms away it goes back if I bring the palms together it will come closer okay right I can bring this one around bring this one around I've still got my phone going I noticed so I can stop that okay I mean, I quite like this, but would I be using it much, to be honest? Probably not. Let's bring it in. Let's go back. Okay, whoa, whoa, up you come. Up you come. Okay, down. Right. And I can't remember now. <laughs> right, I know what you got to do. Obviously, whoa, stay there. Is I'm going to... Stop that. Okay, so it should come back into follow now. Right, to make it come back to you for landing, you got it can't be more than five meters away. If you stick your arm out, returning to palm, the drone will come and landing and land on you. I just moved my hand a little bit because of the wind. But I'm going to end of the lesson now. <laughs> to turn the drone off, guys, you just press the button, double tap. You can see the drone shutting down with the flies all over me. So the drone's off. Now, I've a couple of questions out there because a lot of you have already got this drone, which is amazing. Now, somebody was telling me they just bought the drone without the transceiver thing at the back there. And he had a problem. Well, he said he can't, 
but he can't um, connect his RCN3 controller. Is that right? I don't think it is, but he said he can't do it. I don't know, because I don't want to take this off. That's just at the moment. So I'm putting that out there. Um, somebody else was saying, because I haven't really looked at it yet, because like I said, this is my first day out. I'm trying it out. Yeah, he was saying, if you're using your phone, is it, can you do 4K60 on your phone? I think you can, but I can't say 100% because I haven't looked at that yet. So that's another question I'm putting out. Two questions, see? It'd be great to hear what you would like me to try out, guys. Obviously, there's loads of stuff. This is a vlogging drone. This can do all sorts. I'm already loving it, I'll be honest. I, I, love, the, I love the Neo. It's a fun drone. I didn't really like the talky bit. You know, we've got to talk the ruddy thing. But I do love what else you can do with it. And I can see I'm going to be doing a lot with this. But as always, there's going to be another video coming, right? Sooner!